Throw in. Good B. Oh, good B's got caught. And it's, oh, it's off the post. And uh, Racing Club Rory come close. And at least they'll get out of danger. It's uh, O'Grady. Lovely football, crisscross. And ball comes in the box. Oh, and Beeson makes a great save. And Racing Club Rory perhaps should have scored. Good beat. Fitzgerald has it now, though. And uh, oh, that must have hurt. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear, he comes in and it's Peg. Oh, and it's a header just wide. It's a goal kick. <laughs> oh dear, oh dear. Rolls it out to uh, Salami. Good feet. And uh, oh, it's a penalty. Refs give a penalty and Scott could be the culprit. And it's a chance for Racing Club Robic to take an early lead. Stellos against uh, James Beeson. Can you give Racing Club Rorick an early lead? Oh, it just about goes in. Beeson got a hand to it. But, uh, it's 1-0 uh, to Racing Club Rorick. Good beat. Calmly turns out and gives it beautiful ball to Childs. Luke Childs now out to uh, Edwards. Edwards, one touch. Oh, and just too long for Peg. And it's a corner ball. And uh, great ball in from Jack Edwards. And it's uh, Salami. Steel. Salami again. It's a good ball. It's uh, Josh O'Grady. Oh, and Beast as well, and it's uh, Costellos with his second. Racing Club Rorick deservedly double that lead. And, uh, well, it's filled all over the place. And 2-0. Uh, throw. Here's uh, Edwards. Oh, he's turned well. Brilliant by Edwards. Oh, and he's clipped the bar. Oh, that was a glorious opportunity. And Litchfield needed to score that, really. But a good run from Jack Edwards. Second half of the night. Here's uh, Parsons. Oh, good boy, Josh O'Grady. Just down. And uh, Beeson keeps it in. And, uh, oh, we've... And uh, Lino's pointing for a corner. Yeah, I thought the first one. Okay. It's a corner which uh, Josh O'Grady will take. And it comes. Oh, it's a good header just wide by Jones. And racing uh, Wonga, as Mr. Dutton likes to say, come close again. Edwards. Oh, comes over to uh, Luke Childs. Childs still. Oh, Dixon and Lomas. Oh, good save from Walker. And it's a corner ball. So, no Grady over this. Castellos on a hat trick as well. And it is it. Oh, and Beast makes a good save. Oh, keeps it in. Oh, he's done well. Oh, pulls it back. Comes to uh, Josh O'Grady. And it's a good save from Beeson again. Canane to get it back to the key. Oh, no. Costello's in. Comes back. Now it's O'Grady again. And it's another penalty. Yes. And uh, now it's a chance uh, for Costello to get his hat trick. Beeson's already made a couple of good saves this half. Can he do it again? Oh, he's hit the bar. Oh, yeah! and it goes in. <laughs> and uh, it's now 3 0. Now 
tried the cheeky one and got away with it in the end. And now Patterson can break for Litchfield. Oh dear. And everything going wrong for Litchfield. That ball just about sums a night up, I think. And he's a Parsons. Oh, good run. And it's a good finish, but he's offside and he's unlucky. Crisscross. And uh, Racing Club Rory just. Helping themselves here, it's unbelievable stuff. And it's a great goal, it's 4 0. Super finish. And uh, gave Beast no chance. And uh, who is it? They never turn around, do they, when you want to see the number? <laughs> and it's the right back, Kavanagh. Super finish. Haynes again. Out to Edwards. Edwards puts it in. Oh, can it, Charles keep it in? He does. And a good save from Walker. And it's a goal kick. To Racing Club Rowick and clear. And the referee blows the final whistle and it finishes Racing Club Rorick 4, Litchfield City nil, and a well-deserved win for Racing Club Rorick who made this uh, decent Litchfield City side look very ordinary this evening.